An exact project is arranged in a tree structure. This structure is visible on the left. All objects in the structure have a variety of properties, which will be visible in the bottom left corner. The large pane on the right is the working window. When you open items from the tree, their contents will be displayed in this window. An exact audio project has two major parts, wave banks, which hold raw audio data, and sound banks, which contain instructions about how to play the audio data. At a minimum, an exact project needs to have one of each. We need to start by creating an exact project. Click File, New Project. You'll be asked for a location and a name. Find your project folder, then the Content Audio subfolder. Name the project Tutorial Audio and then click Save. Let's add to this new project by creating a wave bank. Find the node in the tree marked Wave Banks. Right click on this node and select New Wave Bank. You'll see a new Wave Bank node added underneath the Wave Banks node, and you'll also see a new window pop up in the working window on the right. Hit Enter to accept the default name for the Wave Bank. Next, we'll create a Sound Bank. Find the node in the tree marked Sound Banks. Right click on this node and select New Sound Bank. You'll see a new window appear in the working window. Hit Enter to accept the default name for the sound bank. We'll use these two new windows to work with our sound bank and wave bank. Let's make sure we can see them both. Click the Window menu item and then the Tile Horizontally option. Next, we're going to add some waves, raw audio data, and create some cues and sounds that will play them in our game. 